welcome to my channel. Sorry I haven't done a video in a, in a while. Um, so today I decided to do a quick review on the Brow Stylist Sculpture by L'Oreal. And I think it was about um, $7 at Walmart. Um, I decided to try this so I could have something else to put on my eyebrows. Right now I have the browsings. It just takes a bit too long to put on my brows with the browsing so I wanted to see if there was something a lot easier for the days that I'm going slow um, so I got it in the color dark brunette and one side is wax and it has a brush which I like and uh, here's the main pencil I got it in dark brunette um, because I I dyed my hair black so I'm going to try this and I'm going to wipe off one of my eyebrows off and um, we'll see if it works. I'll be right back. So as you can see, I took off most of this eyebrow off um, and then here's my made up eyebrow. Here's the unmade up. So we're going to try this eyebrow pencil to fix up my screwed up eyebrow. So I'm just going to like brush it up best as I can. You know, guys, ever since I got older, my eyebrows have become thinner and thinner to the point where people take pictures of me and they can't even see my eyebrows. So that's why I have to draw them in. So I know the last step is, um, so I know the wax is made for the third step, but I'm going to use the wax first and see how that goes. Cause I usually like to put a wax on first and then I go over it with the pencil or powder. I've been using my browsings, but sometimes my browsings, it takes a while to put it on. So I'm trying to look for something that's almost exactly like precisely my brown. So I just use the wax to like try to shape it out. So now I'm going to use the pencil. So try to make it look like this. Um, here we go. So I'm just starting from the beginning with light brush strokes up. Mm. So far it's easy. Like I'm barely pressing it and y'all seeing this? I'm barely pressing it in. And I'm just gonna put the brush on and just kind of like blend it in. But, um, I use the wax first. Um, so tell me, do you all use the wax first or do you use it last? I like to use the, the wax last, I mean first. <laughs> so the shape's getting better and let me fill it in more because it's still looking kind of sparse. So I'm just going to line the bottom. So far so good. I could tell you one thing, maybe I should have did the wax last. Some of y'all don't even put on wax. Some of y'all avoid the wax part completely. I used to avoid the wax part completely until I tried it. The first wax I've ever tried was a colored wax by um, Benefit. Um, the browsings, it comes with like a colored wax. I, I got a little bit of it down here. Just let me get. I use one of these in case I make mistakes. The reason why I got this is because I thought maybe it would be. Maybe my makeup routine will go a little bit faster than what I was doing with my browsings. I will still use my browsings, but. This is some days I'm running slow 
I'm getting so out of bed, and next thing you know, I have to put on my makeup on really fast. So this, this is starting to look really good, actually, um, with a little bit of blending with the brush and using a little bit of wax to shape your eyebrow or to straighten out some hairs that tend to curl. Um, I would say it looks pretty good. Um, I would say this brow looks a bit darker than that brow, but not by much. So I'm just going to go over here and make them look the same. Yeah, so it's pretty close. I know this brow is already done, but I like to look at very similar. Oops, I, I accidentally drew on my... The only thing I don't like about this is that I hate getting stuff that you have to sharpen every once in a while. But it's a good thing I have my Lancome sharpener with me. It was given to me by my mom. Thank goodness. She's like, you need a sharpener. I'm glad she brought that for me. I would have never... Because I always avoid buying stuff that I have to sharpen. It's just annoying, but... I don't mind sharpening this because it's working out so good. This brush is okay. I would rather use like a spoolie to blend it out. And I have a spoolie here somewhere. Let me go get that actually. You know what? Screw it. It's in my purse. But I think it looks fine. And um... I think I did a pretty good job. This product did a pretty good job. So, I'm very happy with this. It didn't take me that long, I don't think. And I guess that's it for this review. I'm just going to be really technical right here and just like darken it right here. brush it through but yeah so I guess I'll be buying this again um I think I'll buy this when I can't buy my precisely my brow by benefit this is a good alternative and it's cheap it was like around seven dollars at Walmart is by L'Oreal so that's it for this review sorry if I haven't been making any um reviews lately or videos but I will get back to it it's just I've been feeling a little bit tired I don't know why um to my energy levels but I think I'm I tried this green tea gunpowder green tea wow the gunpowder green tea is explosive uh, maybe I'll talk about it and review it in another video but yeah that's what I've been doing and since then my energy has gone up and I think I'll get right back to it. So, um, anyway, Halloween is coming. So I hope everyone has a good Halloween. And I hope y'all have, like, a nice day.